Hey guys, what's up? Hollow here, and today we're going to talk about how I feel about Rise of Iron, and definitely feel free to comment down below how you guys feel about this expansion, and what your thoughts are, whether you agree or disagree with me, because I'd honestly really like to know, but honestly, I liked the new additions um, in the game, even though a lot of it's kind of like reskin stuff or things that they improved on from earlier iterations. I like the new Fallen enemies. I think they're really cool. Better than the original Fallen, but once again, that's just a reskin. But I like it. I like them. I liked how they feel. I liked all the techno cool stuff. I, I, I enjoyed the Fallen. And the Plaguelands area is way better than the Dreadnought, and so is Archon's Forge compared to Core Vorix and Prison of Elders. I honestly really liked Prison, or not Prison of Elders, I really liked Archon's Forge. I played it a lot when uh, the first week that Rise of Iron was out. I really enjoyed it. I had a lot of fun. Um, the story missions were good, even though there was not a lot of them, and they didn't really explain anything. Like, there was just bits and pieces of why you're fighting the SIVA, but not why it's so important, I guess, because there's no real history. They don't really go into that, so it's kind of lame. I wish they would have expanded more on the story side. And the raid is honestly the second, my second favorite raid um, after Vault of Glass, because Vault of Glass is the gold standard for me because of nostalgia. That's what I compare everything to, and that's probably unfair. Honestly, if I would have came in in year two, this might have been my favorite raid. So, I feel like that's saying a lot. I actually have a lot of fun running this one. It's not like Crota, it's fast like Crota's in, but it's more team oriented. There's no like hero concept where one person can save her. It's all team oriented. So, I really do enjoy that. I like the raid, I like the gear. Um, honestly, I just wish there was more content with private matches, more customization. Uh, of course, and I wish there was more story missions, more strikes, more stuff to do because a week goes by and we're done with PvE stuff almost. We're gonna run the raid a couple more times. We're gonna play Trials of Osiris on the weekends and honestly after playing this weekend, I, oh god, it's been rough. And then we have Iron Banner once a month, and then we go into Festival of the Lost and SRL, and then April update again, and then we wait until next fall for Destiny 2. And that sucks because Destiny, you know, should be this huge breathing thing, and it just wheezes all the time. So, that it sucks. It sucks a lot. But honestly, I would give... Rise of Iron, a na not, not a 9 out of 10, whew, a 7 out of 10. It's fun, I wish there was more. If there was just more stuff to do, that would be great. I, w I just wish there was more, and it's unfortunate, but that's going to do it for the video, guys. Let me know how you feel in the comments below about Rise of Iron, and maybe some stuff that you're looking forward to. I'm thinking that maybe we start having fun, and we'll do sub-games where we play, you know, fun game modes and private matches so let me know if that's something you guys are interested in and i will talk to you guys later peace out